All right, so now I have this shape started. I'm gonna close that. And I, the swipe down sometimes makes them move a little bit for me. So I hit duplicate by hitting the three buttons and hit duplicate because I want it to not move on my page. So now I have two of these and I'm going to go to my transform and first I'm going to change my anchor to the bottom corner or bottom center and then I'm going to go to rotation right here and hit 60 and hit OK and it just moved it 60 degrees on the page. Now since it's still um, so since you can still see it connected here, I'm going to hit the three buttons and hit duplicate. And because that pattern is still in that function without touching anything else, I keep duplicating until the product is finished. And I've got six points. And now you can see all of my curves right here. But what I can and do you can't is see them over slide here them all to the right. Because another way to do this symbol. is but what I if you hit the top button slide. and then two fingers on the bottom, that gets everything. And then if I hit the geometry tool and add, that makes it one pattern and not multiple. So if I just did that, let me show you. If I just move one, then it goes back this way. But I want to have them all connected. So I'm going to go back up here and hit add. 